Why I criticized Peter Obi's nomination as Atiku's running mate, Governor Amai. Governor David Amai of Ebony State on Tuesday, October 16, has revealed his reason for criticizing the choice of Peter Obi as the running mate to the presidential candidate of People's Democratic Party, PDP, Al Haji Atiku Abubakar. He said while he is not against the choice of former Governor Peter Obi as the running mate to Atika or his competence for that matter, he disliked the process leading to his, Obi, selection. He said this in an interview with journalists in Rikliki, the state capital, Premium Times reports. He questioned how people from other regions will meet and take decisions that concern the Southeast without the input of a single person from the region. We have never said that we are against Peter Obi, but what we have said is that, if six people can come together from five other regions and look at recommendations for the Southeast and no Southeast person is there, that is not good for us. We have never said that Obi is not good for us, we have nothing against Obi. But we want when decisions that concern us are being taken, we want to be part of that decision, Amai said. Going further, he also expressed displeasure at the imbalance in the initial five-member shortlist of persons being considered for the VP slot. Number 2, the five names submitted, of course, no governors in Southeast wants to be vice president, everybody wants to finish his tenure. The five names for VP should have been five names from the five southeast states, but there was no name from Ebony and Imo states. I am a fighter of marginalization of Ebony people. If we are going to vote, we must be treated with equity. These are the issues, two names came from Anambra, one from Anugu and two from Mabia. So. What is wrong in having someone from Ebony and then one from Maima? These are the issues but they are not as terrible as it is being looked at. I know that my people put me on social media saying so many terrible things about me but it doesn't move me. We must sit down with the presidential candidate and say look if we work together, we must be part of the decision making. I am not talking about myself. I am talking about the leadership of the Southeast. You remember that one of the reasons that the Ebony man is not too comfortable with the issue of the region is that we are afraid of further marginalization. So, these are the issues. Obi is my friend. You would have seen our pictures on the social media. Yes. He is my good friend and we have worked together very very well. He, Obi, said something to me, if I were you, I will be more bitter, I will make a greater noise than you are making. And let me give you one shocking news. I was told in the course of our meeting in Anugu that somebody asked Chekwa Zakari, chairman, United Progressive Party. Why is it that Igbo don't vote for vice presidential candidates from their region and Chekwas told him that any day the Igbo man chooses, is allowed to choose, his vice presidential candidate, the Igbo man will vote for the vice presidential candidate and if you check, be it, Alex, Equim or any other, you will find out that we have never voted along that line.